One. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. It is Friday, of course, which means it is Positively Glad Solo Stream Night. H Man Pulse bringing you live coverage of Mass Effect Andromeda, episode 10. And we've finally um, dealt with EOS, at least for now. Uh, EOS, EOS, I think it's EOS the way they pronounce it, but yeah, we dealt with that for now. Uh, so we don't have to worry about anything to do with that. What we're going to do before we get started, guys, I've got 12 skill points, which the game kept spamming me to upgrade uh, in the previous episode. So we'll have a look. But that pick up is amazing, right? We need to go and get some. Um, Oh, what do I want to do? Um, combat tools. Combat power damage. We'll go for a second one of them, I think. And we'll move to... We'll confirm, obviously. Yeah, we've got to confirm. Sorry, guys. I'm a little bit um, out of control with this. Uh, right, we're going to go for offensive biotics. And hit that there. So we've got a recharge speed. We get that 2%. 2% is definitely underrated, definitely. Uh, effect duration, which doesn't really make a difference with what I've got running on me, but we'll have a look and see if we can look at the other bits and bobs that we have here. Right, uh, six points, so then we can work on... Uh, oh, oh, I'm adept! Oh, hello! Saucy! Uh, offensive tech, we're going to go one, two... What does this do? Tech duration, uh, tech force. Oh, that could work. It, that works. I like that. I like that cheese. We are now Engineer, ranked 1, uh, which means we're going to go back to uh, combat again. With two extra points, we're going to go and throw them on Assault Rifles. It's some accuracy. And there's stability, which is freaking ideal right now, to be fair. It's been awful in terms of... St my shooting has been absolutely pants on this game, basically relying on my um, powers, etc. Uh, but yeah, this has been a really, really fun uh, series so far. But we're, it's going to be kind of a more mellow down episode, this particular one. Uh, we're going to be working on going to back to the Nexus in a moment, but I've got to go and upgrade some more powers. And we've got five people now. Oh, holy moly. Good grief. Uh, we'll bag two, four. Yeah, actually, yeah, we've got two, four. And we're going to use that on charge. So finally, Cora has um, been dealt with there. Uh, vet points of Vetri. So we've got, uh, oh, they're already spent. Uh, so we've got two. Two, 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 and we're going to hit a uh, power armor. So Vetra can become a tank in the field. Oh, that's Ryan said. I thought it was WWE when it said the Nexus was... <laughs> oh, mate. Oh, Ryan, I've downloaded it, by the way. Uh, WWE. Uh, so, yeah, we, we, we both know what's happening there. Right, um, <laughs> one, two, one, two, one, two, one, one. Oh, do I want to incinerate Krogan Warrior? Oh, no, we don't need that. Oh, do I go defense? Ah, we've got to set things on fire. That's kind of how we need to do things. But, yeah. Now, welcome in, Ryan. Uh, yeah. Ooh, oh, yeah, you know I've got that downloaded, bro. But the screenshots and the GM mode look awesome. Uh, I've only downloaded the basic version, so I've got the Undertaker part. But, obviously, what I'm doing is, at the same time, one, two, one, two... One, two. Uh, I'm using Microsoft Rewards, Ryan, when the main game comes out, because I'm going to get another 2,000 point boost. So I'll be able to kind of like use £15 of that, and hopefully I'll be able to afford one or at least one of the DLC packs. So we'll have something there. I'm going to go for... Oh, what's Invasion? What does that do? Oh! Saucy. <laughs> uh, so who's all our powers with everybody so far? And then we're going to go back to the Nexus, because I've dealt with all the crew conversations in the previous episode. So we're going to go one... No, no, come on. No, no, stop. No. Got a frag grenade, haven't we? Yeah. Chuck some grenades around. Absolute scenes. Anyway, I hope you're having a good one, mate. I know you've been hit by the storm. I've been hit by it as well, mate. Uh, oh, I removed the post about um the orgasm. Because uh, <laughs> on the page. Because my door was over the other side of the room and I got told off. <laughs> Funny as shit. Uh, friend spinner. We've got a lot of shit to do on the Nexus. Uh, we don't need that one yet. Uh, priority ops. Uh, heal assignments. Yes. Who's pulling it Ah, okay. I could do that one. I've got loads of things to do, actually. Go for Nilkin. Adriana. That's a tough one, that, by the way, that Adriana one. Uh, that's what I think I'll do, mate. That's what I think. I only have to put like a five or two or something more. Uh, on hold. So I don't need to do that one yet. Speak of Addison's assistant. Uh, Remnant Data Course fan of. Ah, pff, you'll just find them as you go along. Find a scan, call this bodies. I can find them. That's not a problem. 
Uh, probably ups. We just simply these. Oh, better beginning. Speak with Tan. Give EOS radiation time to clear. Speak with Alice. So basically, we just got to go back to Nexus. So let's go and. Uh, oh, what the? Get uh, ladders. D come up. D oh, fucking hell! Right. I've got a hoodie on now, guys. I'm, I'm definitely a spacefarer. And we're gonna go and leave the orbit there. Yeah, I've got a double stream coming around, so I'll hop in for a couple of minutes um, afterwards. Uh, right, we've searched this whole thing. Have we got any more to search? Oh, you know. Oh, I love the galaxy map. It's so awesome, isn't it? Yeah, man, we can obviously do some planning, etc. Uh, after the um, stream. Plan what we're going to do. Because Bish is getting the game as well, so I'll be doing like a double... Well, I'll be doing like three stream series. Like a solo perspective of the career mode, the My Rise. And then I'll be doing um, showcases. Uh, I'll... Yes, there is. I have actually found all the anomalies, and I am a good boy because I've done all my planet scanning. Uh, so, about an hour this stream is going to be uh, something personal. There's a loads of fucking quests to do on here. Uh, so, this will probably this will be the, the well everything I need to do basically as we fly towards the big bubble that is a nexus. Uh, what? Where is it? There we go. Hiding just above a planet. Brilliant. Uh, docking bay. Da, 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 docking bay. Here we go. I do. Awesome. Whoa! Fucking Jesus. Gets shot shot me every time. Uh, <laughs> yeah, tune into Bay's stream for a little bit. I'll probably say a two-year anniversary of forming um, TIR. No idea how that happened. Uh, <laughs> so we're going home. <laughs> That is one of my best burps, I think, in a while. Obviously, all the fucking uh, fluid in my throat, which is pretty awesome. I have got my alcohol ready to help me out with that. <laughs> so here we go, then. What the? Yeah, dot, dot, dot. Sums it all up, doesn't it, really? Um, whoa. We've thought that before. But Eos is different now, right? Pathfinder. All right, settle down. Give him space. Lieutenant Syax, Kendros's aide. They all wanted to see you. Real hope again. It's been a while. Relax, Lieutenant. If there was ever a day to pop some champagne. Certainly. The initiative's finally back on track. Professor Herrick, right? What you achieved with that ah. is unprecedented, Pathfinder. Impossible. But with new scientific talent waking up, we'll unravel those mysteries. The whole Nexus will benefit. We've taken some hard knocks, but this proves we'll always get up again. Always. Awesome. Well, what are you waiting for? Stream going okay, Ryan? Obviously, you know that the internet's been affected slightly today. Cheers, man. Uh, that cut off really quick. Right, um... What the... Find Spender on the Nexus, okay. Watch your tone. You saw what happened to Krogan. But we need this equipment. Well, you're not getting it. Stop making frivolous requests. It's not a frivolous request. Properly functioning air filters are at frivolous stuff about Chisra. You'll just have to make do. Your incompetence is a problem. Just do your job. What do you want? Sounds like you're having a rough day. Bite my head off. You saw that, Prick. Huh? Oh, I'm sorry I snapped at you. The way Spender treats me? A female I'm just Salarian. so angry. I don't understand how he's in any position of authority. I haven't heard much good about that guy. Whatever you've heard, it's not half as bad as the reality. Just like oh boy. he tried to redirect some of the supplies we need to keep the stasis pods going. What? I have no idea. But if Kesh hadn't stepped in and threatened to airlock him, it would have been a disaster. He's a oh my god. Making bad decisions, driving the Krogan away, treating people like scum when no one's watching. Maybe there's something I can do? A man like that's bound to have some dirt. I wish Tan and Addison could see it. Things have gotten so bad that Kesh had to literally kick him out of engineering. <laughs> How are we talking here? Boot to ass. 
Oh, it was. Oh, I wish I'd seen that. As incompetent as Spender is at his job, he's insanely good at keeping it. Kesh can tell you more. Okay. Anything else here we could do in terms of like quests? No, literally nothing. Um, all right. I can go up here now. Oh, sweet. Any exclamation marks or anything? Awesome. We have to operate. There's tons to do up here. So it's just good to kind of get rolling. Six Flags Magic Mountain. That's one hell of a username, whoever that is. I'll fucking find Agent S. I've word here, prick. I just missed the original Mass Effect lift conversations. Right, we've got loads to do here. There we go. Look at all this shit. One. Two. We'll leave the special ops for later. We're going to go speak to Cash first, actually. Hey, Strack! How many times have I told you this story? 343. Wait, <laughs> you count? <laughs> that's not funny. Pathfinder, thanks for helping Raj and Zara find Atheus. If Zara Ford can swallow him whole for all I care. <laughs> Dell told me you saw Let's see what you gotta say. Spender. Jack's doing his best to throttle my department. How is he getting away with that? Spender doesn't know the first thing about engineering, but he knows how to play people. More importantly, he still talks to the exiles. I'm sure of it. I just can't prove it without your help. This needs to be investigated. I'm glad hey, someone man. thinks so. Talk to Canvos. He likely has security footage of some kind of evidence. But you'll have to convince him to authorize release. Nothing more for now. Will do. Let's go speak to Drac really quick. Ryder, can you believe this place? One space station slightly dented? You should have seen it a year ago. It was more than just dented. Anyway, thanks for bringing me on. Tan can't kick me off the station now, and it's been nice seeing my granddaughter again. The two of you stay hey, close. It's been catching me against the galaxy the moment I got her. Well, maybe not as much now, but it sure was early on. <laughs> yeah. Touche. Right, so who we got to speak to now? Kandros. You know we got to jump off here. Hey! Who are you? Why are you staring at me like that? Okay, you go that way. What the fuck? Hey, you go that way. Kondros! Well, can't just go there. No news on the Turian Arc yet. Or is this militia business? I was told I should talk to you about the mutiny. I wasn't on the Nexus when it happened. I started reading up on it, but you know how things get around here. Do you know where Spender was during that time? Why Spender? Wait, you think he might have had something to do with the mutiny? Maybe. Yep. Just trying to sort things out. <coughs> you know, the logs I did look through showed a few discrepancies. I meant to dig deeper. If you're investigating, how about I give you access to the security vid archives? Thank you. Anything else? Was well, he's unexpected. Bye, Kandros. <laughs> Duty calls. You and me both, Pathfinder. A reminder to all personnel, overtime hours remain in effect. Fucking overtime hours, really?
Huh. Here we go. This file won't play. Sam, can you boost the quality? Processing. Playback initiated. Wait, is he handing something over to one of the mutineers? Take this back. It'll help you with the armory. Don't I am sorry, Pathfinder. This backup file is corrupted. The audio tracks are heavily degraded. Someone may have deleted the original, and this version was restored during a system-wide reset. Sounds like a cover-up to me. I concur. Hey, man. While I cannot restore any more audio, the location appears to be Kadara. How do you figure? In common parlance, lip reading. I do not recognize <laughs> the location from any current data. It appears mountainous and populated. We will need to okay. find planets before I can confirm. I will contact you via my node. Okay. Let's go confront him. I think I've got to go up here anyway, so that's handy. What the? Yeah, I'll speak to you, Carrie. Hi. The documentary's going great. Your comments really got people talking. Director Tan loved the first broadcast. Sent a contribution for your expenses. Thanks. Okay. Hmm. Let's get to the juicy stuff. The scientists are excited about your new outpost, though there are questions about how Prodromos can survive where Sites 1 and 2 failed. My team and I surveyed Eos thoroughly, and even stopped the storms. The rest is up to the outpost, but the old threats are gone. Hopefully they can handle any new ones. Facing those risks must be stressful. How do you relax between missions? What do you do? I can't imagine you putting your camera down for anything. I'm not the one history cares about. I need a minute to think about my answer. And I'd like to know. Back home, I'd go sailing. I love the water. Ah. Nowadays, I play ocean sounds, close my eyes, and remember. Okay, your turn. <laughs> There's a lot of drinking, followed by slightly more drinking. This is history, too, these little moments between. Shots of this remnant tech, some narration, that completes an episode. Thanks for stopping. Okay. Right, then, let's have a look, see if we've got any more quests to do here. Add this in, and set and personal. Right, so we've got to go speak to Spender first. We're literally in the right place. Ryder, is it? William Spender. Apologies if we met before. I meet a lot of people running Colonial Affairs. Running Colonial Affairs? I thought you were the Assistant Director. That's right. Assistant to Addison. So we know who does all the real work. From what I've heard, your hands are pretty dirty. I saw the footage. You were handing something off? What footage? <laughs> From Gavorkum? Routine business meeting. Whoever you're talking to clearly has an axe to grind. And frankly, a Pathfinder shouldn't be wasting time on a witch hunt. You'd be wise to let this be. Ah, okay. So we don't need to do that yet. Right, so what I need to do then, I need to speak to... What's the Addison one? Uh, I'm going to speak to this person first. Please address concerns first with Director Addison. One must hey, Russian guy. Up, oh, oh, fine, Jesus. Fuck's sake. You've shaken things up, Pathfinder. My department actually has colonial affairs to direct, and you have new tools to help grow the initiative. AVP, ready for spending. I'll do the exploring. Don't you have someone else to track the numbers? Get off your perch. This is where numbers become lives. You and your team are out there making Andromeda viable. That empowers all of us. Hit a threshold. Mm. A new cryo group can be brought out. Want more nice. research, like on Prodromos? <coughs> That's your call. Brecker will introduce the interface and handle minutia. All you need to do is decide what life in Andromeda means. No pressure. Speak with Adzant, Ad, 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 Addison's assistant, Brecker. Hello. 
Vladimir Breka, C63 Vladimir Breka. The first task is to decide irrevocably the course of every life in the initiative. Whoa, that seems like too much. Yes, of course. But now you respect what we're doing. Andromeda viability and the nexus thresholds are your tools, your reward, and our future. How can I help? What's the rundown on AVP? Much of the preparation in the Milky Way was determining how to measure success. Ah, so I'll set the measuring stick sort of thing in. Okay. But this is about cost. What we can actually afford to support. Points aren't the most elegant system, but it makes it clear. The more you earn, the more we can deploy. So the more I earn... <laughs> how are you measuring so what, we're playing a game of tennis to fucking save people's lives? Resource estimates and the general stability. A metric of 15 love. <laughs> Don't go love 15 down or we lose people. The greater capacity we can accommodate... The more the initiative can do for you. Simplest okay. explanation: the more you do, the more room we have to grow. So I decide what groups to wake up. Won't everyone be out eventually? Absolutely, but there's an order to things, a lines of support. You can't deploy an omelet without first deploying eggs, and eggs won't get you steak. Except it's people and how all our lives begin. <laughs> I like this guy. All right, Brecca. Where do I start? The interface is active and will respond only to a Pathfinder. It's ready for your first selection. You may begin shaping the initiative at your leisure. We await your first application of AVP, Pathfinder. Just access the interface. Where's that then? Oh, hello. Awesome. Now I'll go speak to you again. Pathfinder, AVP leveling continues as per your directions. And of course, the interface remains accessible for any future adjustments. Sweet protocol and process. Now we are living. I'll what speak to this guy. Initiative? I was a teacher. A good life. I caught the positives and negatives right through to the end. You did the math, and it said, come to Andromeda? No. I just didn't like being able to see the end. Here, I, like that. I don't have a clue what tomorrow will bring. It feels more like living. Uh, the basics. Oh, what the? That. Pathfinder? What's your take on the state of the initiative? Please consult the AVP interface. It has a thorough breakdown of your progress. And your personal opinion? Your progress thrills me. Make my job obsolete, Pathfinder. I dare you. <laughs> Another time. Oh, damn it! It's becoming a bit of a saga here. I have a specific person I want brought out of cryo. Name and designation if available. That's it? You'll just do it? Nowhere in my job description does it say, argue with the Pathfinder. Then, <laughs> I record all interactions. If something you ask for causes trouble, there will be no doubt that you're responsible. I heard that the chief engineer on EOS went back into cryo. There have been a few such requests. The first few months in Helios were disheartening. Now the Prodromos is on track. I want her redeployed. Chief Engineer Grace Lito, designation E-97 Durango. Deployment will begin shortly. Is there anything else, Pathfinder? Well, somewhere anyway. It isn't relevant when everyone is doing everything. I suppose it's like uh, caring about a middle name. <laughs> Not many do. I wasn't aware I had one. Hmm. You were in select 
company even before you were made Pathfinder. Scott Rider Pathfinder. Specialist designation A04 Malapa. Hmm. Something interesting? An A and low odds. Hmm. Someone's an early adopter. <laughs> <laughs> I have a specific person I want brought out of cryo. Name and designation if available. Let's keep this between us. Here's the info. Deployment will begin shortly. Is there anything else, Pathfinder? Okay. Another time. Pathfinder. Alright, okay, that's one quest done. Return to Patronus. Right, we'll do that after. Oh, here we go. 82% planet viability there. <coughs> awesome. Okay. Uh, Jill, what are we up to now? Uh... Uh, priority ops. Okay, we need to speak to Tam for that one. All right, Nexus. Let's go speak to Dilkin. What are you doing? <laughs> I hear you went down uh -oh. to EOS. Did you find anything to help my case? You're a liar. The Chief's Omni tool recorded you over the body admitting to killing him. What? Wait, that's not. What are you trying to pull? Sam, playback. Sorry, old friend. Had to do it. I'm not dying on this rock. Well, shit. Guess my fate is sealed. Except that your shot missed. A cat blast to the back killed Reynolds. Are you... Are you serious? I'm innocent? What a stroke of luck. The conviction will have to be overturned. The sentence thrown out. I'm going to Tam. And I might have a different opinion. You did try to cover it all up. Look, I'm mm. sorry I lied. But if my shot missed, I'm innocent. Plain and simple. We'll see about that. Hmm, okay. Uh, right, what's this one here? Basically, just speak to Tan of some sort. Right, okay, yeah, we'll, we're here, what else will we do that now? All, all quests kind of seem to go this way, so... Here we go. Hello. Hello. Good to see you too. You. Last time oh, I hello. Was here, this was a storage closet. <laughs> just needed a pathfinder to open. We're still getting the common barrier ready. Hydroponics is only at partial capacity. Not good enough. We don't have enough people. My workers need a break, Tan. I sympathize, but not until our survival is no longer at risk. Now please excuse me while I meet with our pathfinder. Hey, Ryder. Addison told me about the outpost. You're the hero of the hour. I guess this is one bet that paid off. Point taken. Always revel in your victories. That's why. Hey, Amen to that. Oh, I never doubted you. It was the others. They don't share our vision, Ryder, of a prosperous future in Andromeda. I suppose we agree on that much. I knew that given a chance, your talents would emerge. Deciphering the vault, alien terraforming. It's not how we imagined all this, but a good Pathfinder improvises. Touche. Hangs it on the wall. Whoa. Yours are the first trophies to grace Pathfinder Hall. You're a symbol now, Ryder. A reason for people to believe. 
I plan on doing a lot more than that. That's the confidence you need. Take charge and ignore your critics. Careful. You'll end up adopting you, Ryder. Ah. <laughs> Colleagues, you wouldn't be looking to cut us out, would you, Tan? I remind you, I am the director of the initiative. Acting director. This isn't the time for arguing over who gets to be king. Too much is at stake. We should be cooperating. That's what I've been saying since we arrived. Then I look forward to winning our Pathfinder support. I have concerns about your decision on Eos Rider. An outpost full of scientists won't do as much good if the Ket attack. But it will help support the Nexus. Improved research could help feed our people. And we could argue about it all day long, as we always do. The decision was made. Now we move on. I do like and dislike this guy. We have a lead on the terraforming network. I need to take the Tempest deeper into the sector to investigate. If the other Golden Worlds are where they should be, this could get us closer to them. Careful. The Ked are scouring the cluster for remnant technology. You'll end up in a fight, for sure. You might also run into exiles. They didn't leave the Nexus on good terms. And we still need more outposts. They're important to expanding the station. Though with mm -hmm. Marks still missing, this could be a chance for Ryder to search for them. Yes, I think that's best. You have my permission. I wasn't hmm. really asking for it. Of course. <laughs> I support that kind of enthusiasm. Right. <laughs> hey, level up. Good stuff. This is Harry, back on the Ark. Go ahead. We may have found a way to talk to your sister, sort of. Drop by when Ooh. you can, Hyperion Med Bay. Will do. A reminder, you have AVP outstanding. Right. Have to talk to Addison's assistant about viability perks. Sounds useful. Whole mood of the Nexus has changed since Eos. Mm. You really can feel it. New outpost, a Pathfinder's help, people waking up. Who did leave the next on good terms? Uh, no one left <laughs> in terms of WWE. Heath Slater maybe had the most run. Well, Daniel Bryan, obviously. Darren Young. Pretty half successful career. But it's damn good to know we're on the right uh, leader LGBT, obviously. LGBTQ, before I get insulted. Um, who else is there? <clears throat> David Otunga, I guess. He was half decent. I'm stretching way, but no, I'm really stretching. They all had shit. Ah. Cool. Normandy. And then. Cool to see this, man. Look at some of this shit. Dude, I like this. I love history and shit. This is how we do. Can I switch everything here? Any oh, my God, what's this? Some that. That's for basically that. Okay. Uh, well, I've done that already. So. Literally nothing more I need to do that unless I'm kind of. Oh, these are complete quests, were there? Uh, go to the. Oh, neon system. I've got to do that before I leave. On hold. On hold. Oh, he's up here. Okay. You've had a year to think about it. It's the third director, Tan. Its origin defies all known explanations. How? We brought all that equipment along. <laughs> I will not accept that excuse. This is science, and your merry band over there are scientists, aren't they? Figure it out. Goodbye, girl. It's like, yeah, fuck off. You're off to a promising start. I <laughs> what I said. You are a symbol now of hope. 
that things will get better. Though I worry about this terraforming network. What do we really know about it? It's like nothing we've ever seen. It's clear somebody had big plans for this cluster. But who? Not sure yet, but at least we're on the trail. Did you have some other business? Director, I checked out that murder. Nilkin didn't do it, but there's proof that he meant to. This is unfortunate. We're trying to give the people a sense of stability, leadership they think they can count on. And we're setting precedent for justice here in Andromeda. Now this, a convicted murderer who didn't commit the murder. I hear you. It sucks when things aren't black and white. Yeah, that's a lot. Are they ever? If we suppress the evidence and uphold the conviction, we're banishing a man for a crime he technically didn't commit. No, you release the evidence. Staff, we're freeing a man who tried to take matters into his own hands, then covered it up. Your investigation what do I do here? complicated this. You should take responsibility for the outcome. Do we still exile him for murder? It was no. crazy down there, life and death. But his shot didn't kill Reynolds. We have to let him go. You're a bottom line type of person. I hope we don't regret it. All right, so be it. He will do community service for his role in the chaos. But he's a free man. Well, at least we'll have this mm. business behind us. Something I can help you with? That's What's this? I also have to speak to him with? My pleasure. I see great things in our future. Right, um... Another quest dealt with. <laughs> Bye. Toodaloo. All right, what have we got here then? No other quests on this part. So what we're going to do is... <clears throat> what's this say? Uh... Now we're going up. Right, we're going to go to. We've been to Cryo Bay Habitation Deck. We'll go to Habitation Deck first. See if there's anything down there. This is just literally a case of getting through the missions. I believe part 11 slash 12. Shit's going to pick up. But I couldn't honestly say it. Right, let's have a little look here. What we got? Any exclamation marks? Uh, nothing. We'll walk through. See if anyone says anything to us. I've already done all this, but oh, who are you? You, Pathfinder. I have a word or two for you. Is there a problem? Your father is my problem. He's everyone's problem. We're oh. all paying for Alec Ryder's ego. He preyed on Jean Garson's trusting nature and bulldozed us to this godforsaken place. Now she's um. dead, and we'll all soon follow. Hey, my dad died for this dream. He was trying to fix things for all of us. Some dream. He fixed us all right. Go to hell, Pathfinder. What a kick in the face, you or what? Fuck off. Lucky I don't give a shit what you think, anyways, so that's fine. Uh, right, moving on. Fucking idiot. Hey, three of you, thanks for watching, guys. I uh, hope you're okay. All uh, right. Nope. 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 Lonnie. Hello. Pathfinder. Oh. Take care. But yep. Shut. Fuck off. <coughs> oh. You're floating. Um, just to confirm, guys, yep, she is actually floating. I'm not going to speak to you. You're an intimidating, intimidating sausage. 
Uh, right, have I got a... Uh, is there any uh, priority ops? Go to Onion. Allies. Missing arcs. No. Yeah, I'm going to go and... Sp I'm going to go to the Cryo Bay, then come back here, I think. There's not much emotion in this game, really, but... I guess if you kind of come at it from just like a completely cold position, then it is quite emotional. This is Agent S. <laughs> Beat you through it, you bastard. All right, foot manager coming up, guys, in around about uh, 20, 25 minutes. And then I've got to watch some wrestling, which is going to be cool. Uh... Oh, we got two. Ah, two go quite two cheeky quests. I like that, Jeez. I like this. I like this. Hey, medic. Oi, Pathfinder. Today has not been a good day. Why is that? A large shipment of medical supplies intended for Prodromus was intercepted by those damned exiles. Scouts oh, got about they divided the supplies up among their own outposts. It would be nice if the people you banish would just mind their own business, but they never do. <laughs> And then it's super easy to take back what they took. Maybe when you come across them assholes, you can rectify all this. I can if you want me to. I really, if you want me to, I can, but I can't ever say anything. Oh shit, we'll pass him. Dr. Carlisle, hello. Harry, what's happening with Sarah? Well, we got her out of the pod. I don't want to get your hopes up, but Sam managed to uh, find her. You might say. I don't follow. Well, she's still. Oh, she's a pretty one, isn't she, bless her? But she also has an implant like yours, and Sam managed to access it. He's made contact. That's incredible. She's okay. Vitals are steady, but I'm letting Sam take the lead on this one. No in a coma. Sarah's mental processes remain intact. Of course. Is she okay? You can ask her yourself. A moment while I establish a link with her implant. Proceed. Oh! Sarah? Can you hear me? Scott? Is that you? What's happening? Where am I? There was a problem with your stasis pod. You're in a coma on the Hyperion. Do you understand? Uh, I think so. Am I dreaming? Sam linked into your implant, but they say you're stable. You're safe and sound in the med bay. This is so weird. I hear you, but I can't feel anything. Where's Dad? Is he doing okay? I don't know how to say this, but he's dead, Sarah. What? It was a freak accident. But it's Dad. He can't die. He... I know. It's been hard on everyone. Oh, they've done great on this part of the game. I didn't get to say goodbye. No one did. What about my new home? Dad kept telling me how beautiful it would be. Just wait till you see it. It's amazing. Even better than the hype. At least that's something. I should it's true, I guess. You. Well, you were never one to quit, Sarah. A little nap won't hold you back. <laughs> At least mom and dad are back together somewhere. We will be too. Right here. I hope so. I. What happened? The connection was only temporary. Her condition remains stable. Fuck, you know. Sorry, it seemed better than. <sighs> I'll keep you posted. Promise. Thanks, Harry. 
I like the connection between some of the characters. They've done a lot of work that which doesn't get really get credited. <laughs> Never had that problem. All <laughs> uh, right, we're gonna go back to the docking bay. Then we oh no, I need to go back to habitation to Sam. Don't I? We'll go back to Sam really quick. Sorry, back in a bit. Log off. Not taking personal calls today. Let's go speak to Sam Node. I did unlock two memory fragments, so you never know. It did say come back to Sam Node, didn't it? I'm sure it did in the middle of the um EOS. Ow! Bastard. A little bit of a shock then on my arm, that's weird. Make sure the um headset's wired in properly. Thoroughly enjoying this game at the moment. Oh, nothing yet. Okay. Let's go this way. Your father's personal logs. If you knew that log is not currently accessible. Unlocking my memory array may enable it. Ah. I am Dr. Liara Tassoni, and I've been well, I am not interested. Back to docking bay, though. I'm actually be able to leave. In this episode, still got about 13 minutes to go. I'm trying to keep it to an hour apiece, because I don't want people sitting there watching my videos for like four hours at a pop, like, you know what I mean? Docking bay, sweet. Managed to get right to the end. Okay, all right, let's have a look here. Oh, there is another quest. Whoa, what the? There's a couple of question marks. What we're gonna do? We're gonna go upstairs then, I believe. Shapiro, hey, hello. I've got power shortages throughout the station. I can't for the life of me find the cause. Oh, whoa, you, you're the pathfinder. Hey, sorry, please ignore me. You've got way more important things to do. Ah, da ba 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 ba. Power to the Nexus is pretty important. I'm happy to help. That, that's great, because I'm at a loss. There are obvious short circuits cropping up all over the place. A pathfinder's eye might reveal something. There's a power short here. We could scan the area. A reminder that alcoholic beverages must be consumed within driver's corner or at the vortex. Oh. Okay. What the fuck is this shit? Where is it? 
Ah, gotcha. Oh, God damn it. Ah. I guess maybe I'll be the last quest of the night then. I'm in need of a drink. I've got loads of them. Oh, all right, just Agent S, you don't need to lead us on this merry chase, fella. Where are you, bastard? Where are you, bastard? An animal did this? Affirmative. Uh -oh. I am able to track it. Oh, no. I remember this quest. <laughs> you will be amazed, guys. Pathfinder, I believe you found the culprit responsible for the power shortages. Alert Professor Herrick to come secure it. <laughs> hey, another level up. Awesome. Now we've got to go all the way back to the docking bay and go back to do some more quests. Lovely. Oh, put that. Who are you? Oh, speech. See what we got to say. About what? My friend Jory was on EOS the first go round, barely survived. Now they want him to go back. They're saying the conditions are improved, that that it's safe now. What the You can believe the reports. EOS is becoming a livable and sustainable space. Going back to reclaim it will help heal your scars. See Jory? It's going to be okay. Thank you, Pathfinder. Uh I'll do that. Interesting. That may help us out later for something. Any any other quests here? Actually, that's a point. Um, no. No question marks. No. No. Let's just go back to the docking bay. We're gonna get a raid going soon, guys. Thank you very much for staying tuned. We'll have to wait and see. Oh uh, yeah, so the next part of the plan for episode 11 is to go back to the Tempest, maybe have a little bit of crew conversations and see what the rest of the galaxy has in store, I guess. Um, uh, map. Anything else over here? I'll have a little run around, see if we can see anything. Hey, bro. Oh. Nope. 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 I have a funny feeling we're going to be coming back here later with six rooms that you can't explore yet, but we'll... Tech Lab, back here for the first time in a while. We can Pathfinder Rider, if you will. Once we get more biomaterial. Hello, Pathfinder. A moment. What can I do for you, Doctor? I have a math problem. Some vital equations that only a mind like Sam's could solve. They concern oh, boy. transmission patterns in the scourge. Perhaps random noise, perhaps not. Sam likes new experiences. It'll be an opportunity to encounter math homework. Given the complexity and the security implications, I recommend transferring the equations directly into SAM node. I have them on an optical storage disk for you. I'll see if I have time. Thank you, Pathfinder. Please thank SAM as well.
Yeah, I think this will be the last thing I do. I think it's the last quest I can actually do, as far as I'm aware. I think I remember this one. And it's a pain in the ass. Run, rabbit, run, rabbit, run, run, run. As we go straight to Sam now to help him do some maths homework. Welcome back, Scott. Uh-oh. Dr. Arbor Dana at the tech lab sent some equations for you to solve. I'm ready. Transferring them now. Have fun. Hey, what the? Sam! Malicious code detected. Please stand by. Sam? What the? Attempting to countermand malicious code. Please stand by. Is there what? anything I can do? Sam? Is that another malfunction or. Sam, you trying to show me something? Okay, I think I got it. Sam, talk to me. Hello, Pathfinder. Please initialize the console to restore normal operations. Sam. What the? The equations contained a Trojan horse program, a virus. Specifically, oh, of course. Our connection and render me helpless. Reconnecting would be impossible. Ah. How do you feel? Are you okay? I cannot feel pain. However, I would avoid repeating the experience, which is the purpose of pain in organic life. Unlock the door. <laughs> Let's head to the tech lab and see what Dr. Aradana has to say. Oh boy. This is our first big quest, as far as I'm concerned. Fucking little bitch trying to poison me. Kill off my AI. How fucking dare you. So I guess I'm going to walk this way a minute. Uh... We can, uh... Okay. I got three of Bish. Yeah, we got a little... We got someone called Bish for Raider. That's intriguing. Oh, stop moaning. Exactly, could be dead. Yeah, shut the fuck up. I'm certain, Professor. Welcome, Pathfinder. Did Sam solve the equations I sent? Oh, boy. Solve them? They almost brought down Sam Node. The equations contained a virus designed to target artificial intelligence. You think I... Never. I abhor violence against any life, organic or synthetic. I'm sure you wouldn't hurt me or Sam, but I need to investigate. I understand. Oh, boy. Hmm. I've seen a lot of down with AI sentiment lately. Graffiti, complaints to ten. Perhaps someone took the next step. Why would anyone hate artificial intelligence? Synthetic life has different needs and motivations. It can be mysterious and powerful. Many fear what is not understood. What the? Whoa, what the hell is going Right. Oh, the tablet's fucking up. Fuck's sake. Right, one minute, guys. I'm literally going to be doing a raid right after this. Maybe they just want to feel safer. Attacking Sam is bold, though. I wonder if there have been... <sighs> God. Things. The AI kiosk was busted this morning. Like Come on. Uh, Fuck off. Woodsy, I like the new Twitch name. Sorry, bro. Forgive me. Um, tablet's got absolutely mental. Look at the anti-AI activity on the Nexus. 
Uh, you've joined them, Woodsy. Literally, she can help me do a raid, matey. Um, I'm going to be do having a 10-minute break before I go back on uh, Football Manager. Uh, raid. We're going to go to Rhea Bish, funnily enough. Um, so, yeah, thank you for watching, guys. Um, we're going to be jumping in. If you want to jump in the raid, Woodsy, do a little hashtag pause raid action. Uh, but, yeah, literally about to head off. <laughs> Uh, right before I go on foot manager in 10 minutes. Um, there is a female bish, yes. It's kind of scary. She looks a lot prettier than bish does, anyway. Uh, clearly, she got the good looks. Uh, right, guys, thank you for watching. Uh, I'll be back with Mass Effect Andromeda after my race tomorrow, funnily enough, which is around Brazil. Make sure you check out Massey underscore F1 for that. In the meantime, guys, go check out Rio Bish. Watch off.